then I realized it was more than just a place. It was a person. You. I saw you up on that cliff. You were dressed exactly the way you were in the locket, except your hair was blowing in the wind. And I saw myself. We were in love. We met there on the cliff at night. We went down to a cave where we could be alone. A cave? At the bottom of the rocks. I made love to you there. And then you gave me the locket with your picture in it. And I put it in a box and I hid it in a niche in the cave. Why? I was afraid I might lose it. I thought we'd be back there again. But I never saw you or the cave until last week. Amos Meredy took care of that. There is no cave. Yes, there is. I spent all of my summers at Spindrift when I was a child. I know every inch of that coast. It was a hundred years ago. The entrance was only visible at low tide. Now it's underwater. The cave is there. I found it. And I found the locket right where we left it. I don't believe you. I'll show you. You willing to take a swim? Okay. I take the wheel, I'll go forward. You afraid? Yes. Of me or the truth? I don't know. It's about five feet down, three or four feet under the rock. If you lose your nerve, we're in trouble. I'll be all right. <laughs> 